This is Deborah Green, fan reporter of the Baltimore Ravens for Fan Media Network. Here at the Art Modell Field at Merville High School, the Northwood Pop Warner Football League has a new place to call home, thanks to the Baltimore Ravens. They stretch, they dance, they sing. Wait in line to get their pictures taken. Register people to vote. Even practice on your interviews. My name is Tyrone Tongue, I'm number nine. My name is Julie Howard, number seven. Why do y'all like playing football? Because it's, it's fun. fun. Did I mention they tackle? The Northwood Rams, four-time National Pop Warner football champions, finally have a field to call home after eight years of searching for a place to call their own. It's wonderful because, hey, when I played in Little League, we played on sand. Mm -hmm. This is beautiful, and I want to thank the Ravens personally and everybody who had a part of, on behalf of 79 and the whole Northwood League, thank you. This is what we needed. Like they say, if you build it, they will come. Merville's $1 million renovated field by the Baltimore Ravens and NFL football allows the team to play on turf similar to the field used by the Ravens. Pop Warner Football League, unlike the HB League, allows teams to play for the national championship at Disney World instead of at M&T Bank Stadium. Program director Clifton Nelson hopes football can continue transforming lives of athletes on and off the field. As you can see, um, this is our homecoming. It really, Little League football vitalizes the community. Um, the youth are the future. We always say that. And we're giving, as of right now, we have two programs here playing. We have um, the Northwood Football League. We also have players from Charm City, First and Ten Cowboys, which are from Emerson Village, and Marlow Heights, which is from PG County. So that's three teams. Each team has approximately 25 to 30 players. So you're talking about 360 kids that's here right now from 9 o'clock to 7 o'clock at night when we probably wrap up that's here doing something productive, not getting in trouble, whereas otherwise, who knows what they could be out there doing. Them football skills on the field, we teach them positive skills off the field as far as uh, in school, at home. Stay in the house all day and not have fun, but you can play football and have fun with it. And be, and be with your teammates. Rams country pioneer and two-time national champion coach Herb Estep passed on his legacy down to his son Kevin Estep Jr. and grandson Rashad Estep. What it means to me to play for Northwood football, well, it, it has been running in my um, family, such as my brother who's, who graduated from Bowie State, who is now a um, coach at Tech, Prairie View A&M in Texas. And it's just... It's a lot of fun, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's a lot of fun. A league that grooms NFL potential. Just ask Tennessee Titans defensive end Vincent Fuller's mother and brother. We also got a big school police. And do you look at him as a role model? Coming out here yes. working. They want me to reach out to the goals that he did. And by doing that, they may win number eight, too. But it wouldn't be Rams country without the mouth of Northwood. Earlene Ward, who played defensive end for the Baltimore Burns. Started doing this a long time ago. I guess it's been about um, probably 15 years or more. My son was playing. He's 24 now. So I just picked it up one day. Somebody else was doing the calling and he had to leave. I picked it up and mm -hmm. I enjoy it a lot. I enjoy making the kids feel special because I think that's what every coach is out here trying to do. You know. How important is it for the kids to be involved? It is very important that, that the kids are involved. And in, in, in Northwood, we've been doing it I mean, for years. We have a, a very strong tradition. You know, we, we are national champions more than once, more than twice. I think we're like four times national champs. You know, uh, at one time we were back-to-back, 11-14, -back, back-to-back uh, national champ down in Florida. Mm -hmm. And um, that was big. You still see our games on ESPN, and the kids love that. They are
It's a homecoming celebration here in Lance country, the home of true Pop Warner football. In Baltimore, Deborah Green, Fan Media Network.